Okay, hi everyone. Welcome back to Our Groovy Life. So today, Gabby and I are going to taste some spicy chips. So this is why I'm back on the, this side of the camera from some that we have been recording lately because my wife and daughters have been doing candy and I'd much rather partake in the spicy, spicy. stuff, right? So this afternoon, Gabby and I are trying three hot chips. Jay's Hot Stuff, Lay's Flamin' Hot Dill Pickle Remix, and Bugle's Hot and Spicy. Hot and spicy. Now, if you're looking at those going, what in the world do those have to do with each other? Absolutely nothing. Nothing. They're oddballs. They're oddballs. <laughs> They're so the we ones have that a didn't fit into a bunch. category. Yeah, they didn't fit into any other category. They're what we had left over. They all say hot. Now, if it makes anybody feel better, I'm happy to put them by size. <laughs> so, that's what they have in common with each other is that they grow in size, left to right, or right to left. Left to right. Yeah. All three of them are in bags. All three and are they in say bags hot and they on say them. hot on them. <laughs> so that's what we're going with. Um, as well as that, what do we got today, Gab? We have the Icelandic water, and we have had this one before, and this one is so good. Um, again, from Iceland. I actually didn't even like read anything about this. Oh, this Ulfus, I'm probably butchering that name. Ulfus Springs is where this water is from um, in Iceland. It's a yeah. spring, natural spring water. And it is my wife Bethany's favorite, favorite. water. Favorite, yep. So here we are drinking some when she's not even on the camera. Uh -huh. Yeah, Olfus <laughs> Spring, Iceland. I wonder how far away from the Blue Lagoon it is. Mm -hmm. We could sit in the Blue Lagoon and drink Icelandic, Icelandic water. Icelandic water. <laughs> we could sit in Icelandic water drinking Icelandic water. That would be awesome. Maybe it comes out of the faucets Blue in Blue Iceland. Blue. Yep. <laughs> Maybe. All right, so here we go. Here are the... I can smell those pickle ones from all the way over here. So Gabby usually only likes pickles that are cold or in the refrigerator. Yeah, so I don't we probably like should have put these in the refrigerator. <laughs> Flamin' Hot Dill Pickle Remix. I'm not sure what the remix part goes after. Oh, but. they're all like super big. Oh, are, no. They're huge. Oh. Here, Why? I'll take that one. I just, I don't need But that's not any bad. Okay, whatever. You want to try one? I'll try one. Oh. This they're, they're all big. I guess I could have stepped on it real quick. Oh. Mm. Mm -mm. Oh, that's too pickly. Oh, there's no spice. That's all pickle. Oh my. Oh, I don't like that one. <laughs> wow. I'm not. <coughs> I'm still trying to figure it out. Not a fan. Mm. Again, only like pickles straight from the jar. I don't like hot pickles. I don't like pickle flavored anything. Straight out of the jar pickles. That's the best way to eat a pickle. This one's kind of growing on me, actually. I actually kind of like that, and I don't know why. We get like nine chips in the bag. <laughs> If I wanted just a really weird pickle or really weird chip, the pickle extra hot or flaming hot, flaming hot, flaming hot dill pickle remix. It's kind of like when I eat my Craw my craw daddy chips yeah. from New Orleans that people look at me weird because they're so different, but I like them. This kind of is reminding me of that a little bit. Is it no, like the Memphis you. hot stuff where they put? Pickles on it. Mm -hmm. The Memphis hot. Nashville. Na Nashville, Nashville hot. Nashville and hot put barbecue chips sauce and stuff, and they mm -hmm. it tastes kind of like that. Mm -hmm. All right, so definitely not a Gabby thing, but I think they're good. I would buy them again just for myself to take to lunch at work or something. But those are kind of fun. Mm -hmm. They really are. So, all right. So bugles. Bugles. Oh, these you can't even put on your fingers. Who's good? Ooh, my mm -hmm. fingers don't look like that. My fingers are probably too big. I 
I can go on the fingertip. Oh no. I still to this spicy. day, no, they're not spicy at all. I don't know to this day what a bugle is. I don't mind them, I kind of like them. I think they used to make oh, one no. that was actually a nacho cheese. That was tasty, but I don't know what a bugle is. Mm -hmm. Do they still make it? Oh. Mm -hmm. And a ranch. I can only get it on my pinky, really. Oh, it's got a box top. Box top. Yay. Mm. I like these. Okay, I do too. I like them very much. They're just, they're not spicy at all. Uh, is it, I think it's got like, in like the corn over here, it says corn chip or something. It does? No. no. Not in the bag. Corn, crispy corn sacks. Okay, I didn't even know that before. That's America's number one finger hat, right on there. Not this one. They did, it yeah. says it on the bag. This is the only one that is a finger hat. I my, really like these. My experience with bugles is very limited. So the finger hat thing, I'm, I don't have a lot of experience with that. Yeah. I like these. They're fun. Mm -hmm. Again, not spicy in the least. No. And if my memory serves for the nacho cheese ones, I probably like those better. But this is one I actually could see dipping in like a cool, a cool ranch. ranch. Yeah, like a not just a ranch sitting out, but a a, a cool like a cold ranch that was in the refrigerator would actually make it really taste nice. I like them. They're like they almost they almost look like Chex Mix. Mm -hmm. They do. Chip form. As I'm looking at them, they're reminding me of little wizard's heads. Okay. I really like those. So they're tasty. They're I, not hot. They're not spicy in any way, shape, or form. But they're really tasty. They just have a nice flavor to them. I think I can eat the whole bag. I yeah, think these kind are kind of dangerous. That these are really some good. that I could take to lunch as well. I'll put them oh. into a. Oh, see that? Only one and one third cup. One and a third cup is only 160 calories. That's pretty darn good for chips anymore. It's the air that's in the center. It must be it. Yeah, I, I, would, I would put some of those into a Ziploc bag and take them to work. Absolutely. Always a very uh, refreshing water. I had to stop and taste some of my icky Icelandic water. It's just... I know we talk about it in several of our videos, and some of you probably still laugh at us. So why, why do we try water? Water is water. It's really not. I mean, I wish you could taste this with me right now. Yeah. Icelandic water just tastes different, or doesn't taste. I, I'm not exactly sure what it is. I'm not a chemist, but it just tastes phenomenal. It's very refreshing. Probably the pH. It's, I don't know. Maybe there's pH something level. to do with the pH. Maybe it's higher or lower than 7, 8. I, I really don't know. It has an 8, 4. An 8, 4, so it's higher yeah. pH. I think that's probably one of the highest that we've tried probably is, is the 8, it 4. It could be, but it so. is just an exceptional water. It's one of those that I go, Lord, if I was a billionaire, I would make them make ice cubes out of. Mm -hmm. That would be my ice cubes in my glass, glass of... of Johnny Walker Blue. Be yeah. Awesome. If Johnny, oh, where's Dad's Johnny Walker Blue and his Icelandic ice cubes? That'd be great. On the yacht. On the yacht. Yeah. Oh, really? Can't we afford another set to bring home? That would be awesome. Okay, so Jay's. We know that we love Jay's. Jay's is a great brand. And the hot stuff, they're always a little bit spicy. I know that serves. these ones are spicy. Mm -hmm. We've had these chips before, and so just good. Right. These up for grabs now. Yep, they are up for grabs. Okay, so just a solid chip. They're not crazy hot. They just they have a little bit of heat. I was expecting to be sweating. Mm -hmm. They just taste good. They almost kind of look naked. Yeah, we've had some bags before these that are much more red. Red, much, much more red. Mm -hmm. But they're just tasty. Mm. All right, so we don't need to keep moving on about these particular snacks because they're good. Well, they're good. Not that one. They're great. There's nothing else we can say about them. I think that our, our 
mix episode of Crazy Chips was successful. I like these very much. Gabby does it. Bethany does. The Bugles, Gabby and I love. Bethany doesn't. And the Jays, Gabby and I love. And Bethany doesn't think they're hot at all. But they taste great. And I'm the guy who loves hot stuff. But yeah, they, they just all taste mm. great. The Icelandic water is great. So we would recommend any of these three chips. At least two thirds of us would recommend each <laughs> single bag with no reservations whatsoever. They're just great. And I would buy these again no matter what. So uh, thanks for stopping by everyone. We will see you with more chocolate, chips, Noodles, noodles, Bloody Marys, Bloody Marys, whatever happens ice cream. to come up, ice cream, Chex Mix, and Chex Mix, we have a bunch coming of Chex Mix, up. coming soon to a YouTube channel, near you, really near you, <laughs> so thanks everybody for stopping by, we'll see you later, bye bye, bye,